proudly presented by Smart Hire. Today, Smart Hire will be demonstrating how to operate the JLG 405R 12 metre scissor lift. Before operating, make sure to fully customise yourself with all safety regulations and warnings, as well as the emergency let down handle, indoor and outdoor settings, the horn, and the idle speed controls. To begin operations, first withdraw both emergency stop buttons at both the base and the top before switching the controls to the bottom console. From here, you can adjust the height of the basket, pulling the switch up in order to raise and pushing it down in order to lower. Then, to operate the basket, switch the controls to the top and safely enter the machine, maintaining three points of contact with both your hands and feet. Safely unlocking the protective gate, entering and ensuring it is locked again. Commencing the positioning of the machine, flick the operating switch into drive, squeezing the joystick handle and pressing forward in order to drive forward, and reversing backwards in order to drive backwards. Then, press the top left button in order to steer the wheels left and the top right button in order to steer the wheels right. Once in position, flick the operating switch into the elevation setting and like before, pull the joystick backwards in order to lift higher and push forwards in order to lower the platform. If necessary, the platform can be extended for greater reach and working area. This is done through the release of the side handle lock and compression of the foot pedal lock before sliding the platform into the extended position and securely locking the platform once more. When done, simply reverse the process and contract the platform until it is condensed, relocking the handles for security. Finally, when done, make sure that either one or both of the stop buttons are compressed before exiting the machine safely. Make sure to plug the scissor lift in on charge when not in use. To hire this machine and many more, visit the team in store at Smart Hire.